So I couldn't think of any better video to come back from a break than the one that you're about to watch right now. Yes, you read it right, the mighty Corona virus. What's up with it? Why do we need to worry about it? Why do we need to be aware or why should we stop stressing our mad balls about? What can you and I do to fight this son of a bitch off and how can we keep ourselves healthier and safer in the long run? Well, let's talk all about it in today's upload. Gentlemen, my name is Mangal Asarya. This is Mental Essentials. Let's roll. Thank you. Okay, so if this is not a wake-up call for you, I don't know what is. I mean, it's there. It's everywhere and people are freaking the fuck out about it. So gentlemen, my job here is to help you calm down a fair bit. The coronavirus. What is it and what do we know about it? Well, Wikipedia says coronaviruses are a group of related viruses that cause diseases in mammals and birds. In humans, coronavirus can cause respiratory tract infections that are typically mild, such as the case of common cold. But it also has some rarer lethal forms such as SARS, MERS and the current ongoing COVID-19. So in my layman's lingo, it's just a crazier, scarier version of the regular common cold caused by coronaviruses. It has a one person mortality rate, which means one out of every hundred human being contracting this may die. And it is 10 times scarier than the average common cold. And that's kind of spooky. Now, if you have been watching this channel, you would know that I have actually sat down with Patrick B. David and I did an interview with him two years back whenever he was in India. And I am an avid follower of Chris Gethin and Joe Rogan's podcast. So the content that you're about to listen to or learn from this video is heavily based on Patrick B. David's two-part series on coronavirus, Joe Rogan's latest podcast, and Chris Gethin's take on how do you deal with it, how do you fix yourself, how do you prepare yourself for any of these epidemic in the future, not epidemic, pandemic in the near future. Because see, at the end of it, this disease has taken lives. It is lethal and it is scarier than your usual common code. But that's how any pandemic has been and that's how it will always be. You see, chances are we might all get infected, chances are we might all contract it, build our immune system to it, get over it and live our happy life ever after. But chances are if there are some people with weaker immune system, chances are if there are some human beings contracting it with a not so prevalent system in their body, they might actually die from it. And chances are, the scarier part being, we don't have enough hospital beds in our country, considering the generous population we live in, to treat ourselves and to help us get better with it. And that's one reason we need to restrict ourselves, that's one reason we need to be aware, we need to make it easier for the hospitals and nursing homes. So, doesn't matter if you are young or old, if you are someone with a weaker immune system, chances are you should be aware, chances are this will get to you sooner than later. What you can do right now about it is stop stressing out. Because see, the more you stress out and the less aware you be of the situation, the more you shoot up your cortisol, the more stress you put on your immune system and the more vulnerable you get, the more vulnerable your immune system gets to this virus or disease. I mean, see, we can obviously restrict ourselves, we can obviously limit our social interactions and put ourselves in the self-quarantine phase as they are saying, but what after this? This will eventually pass, coronavirus will eventually go, but what after this? Gentlemen, are we still going to ignore our health? Are we still going to weaken our immune system? Are we still going to go out, have saturated fat, smoke, drink and do everything else that we can to fuck up our own body? Or are we going to use this as a wake-up call to start working on our physical better self. Because very honestly speaking, I don't see a point waiting for these pandemic cases to happen for us to get a wake-up call and start working on our overall physical well-being. I mean, tell me, how many times have I spoken about multivitamins, omega-3 fatty acids and vitamin C? How many times over the years, over the seven long years of doing this, making these videos, have I not recommended you to get these supplements in your system and start building your immune system, start living a healthier life? How many times have I not done that? For you but you still don't take me seriously you see going to the gym lifting weights or going out for run swimming and all these things aren't only for your big biceps and six-pack abs they are not only for your vanity affair this is actually supposed to make you stronger both physically and mentally this is actually supposed to make your immune system be that much more efficient and proactive especially in these case scenario so the next time you do go to the gym the next time you do step out to run or build your cardiovascular endurance or your muscular strength keep this one thing in mind that you're not doing it only for your vanity visual affairs you're actually doing it 
to have a stronger healthier immune system you are actually not smoking you are actually not consuming a whole bunch of alcohol every week and because you want to have a stronger sustaining immune system and you would want to live a longer healthier wholesome life now i catch cold very often i am allergic to a whole lot of things outside especially pollution pollen grains and everything else that you could think of but had i not been running had i not been doing weight training had i not been exercising had i not been working out had i not been eating right and have i not taken some decent care about my physical my immune and my overall well being i would have had been a whole lot more sick than what i am right now now sure i may not have the 17 inch biceps but i do have a decent immune system to take care of myself in these case scenarios if i do end up contracting any such diseases no not because of this current stupid case of covid 19 but because you really deserve to live a healthier longer life because you and i both deserve to live longer in a healthier way of life start eating right start supplementing right start doing cardio start weight training start doing everything else that you can start avoiding a lot of saturated oily food or consuming excessive alcohol and stop ruining your own goddamn system it's about time it's about time we all wake up and genuinely honestly start taking care of our physical self fix yourself fix your lifestyle and fix your goddamn system gentlemen it's about time we start doing it right i want you to live long i want you to be around i want you to watch all the videos on this channel and all the future videos also on this channel so please 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 take care of yourself take care of everyone around and live a healthier stronger life from now and for everything else there is men's essentials thousands of videos you can watch both on the english and the hindi channel and you can Obviously check out TMB basic signature collection I'm wearing the white one right now. This is a premium modal spandex fabric, one of the best possible t-shirts, one of the best possible luxury t-shirts, premium t-shirts that you can buy for yourself. I mean, H&M has it, Zara has it, Brooks Brothers have it, but they are selling it for 1500, 2000, 2500 rupees, but we are getting the same or even a better fabric and a better fit than them for you at an exceptional price. Try it in case you haven't. I think you'll be mind blown by the fit and the quality of the packaging the t-shirt everything that there is the white and the black crew neck we'll have the v neck soon but there you go basics online signature series online our spring collection is online go to timbasics.com and get yourself one of the best possible t-shirt without stepping out and wear them and then step out get yourself the cardio get yourself the run that you need to build your cardiovascular system to build your immune system to be a healthier safer one i'll get back to work now or probably i'll get some water to build my immunity and then get back to work soon the next one rest up stay strong stay safe my name is vanga sir Thanks for watching. Jan take it.